to you now with Michael Winslow. He is going to be appearing at Comedy Quarter in Nina, new comedy club. Um, tickets still available for two shows tonight, right? Uh, they are, but you better you better do this soon. Yeah. Get them soon. No kidding. I might Absolutely. have to bring my husband and, and come out and see you. Um, and two tick, uh, two shows tomorrow night, too. Mm -hmm. 7.30 and 9.30, guys. Is that right? 9.45. All right. Good deal. Um, but you love to cook, I hear. But your wife keeps you out of the kitchen. Because I, I break things. I, I completely... <laughs> I, I understand your lovely wife Sharon talked to her on the phone, and mm -hmm. uh, she keeps you in the den, which is probably a good place. Oh, I'm, yeah, but I'm I'm there. I'm I'm ready. I'm like I'm like a fire department that's not going to be called. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want my husband in the kitchen either. It's kind of a control thing, I think. Why not? <laughs> because he doesn't know what he's doing. Okay, so we're making tuna steaks. Oh, excellent. Yeah, you went and caught these. I heard. Hey, hey, catch a tuna steak with a captain at the boat. Yeah, you and you know what? I love tuna steaks. They're really aren't those oh, beautiful. Oh, look at this. Can Pick you get a look up? at this? Can we get look at that yeah look at that. yeah That's aren't those great um and we're gonna make them even better because we're gonna make a quick easy marinade and we're gonna use oh. our blender i know you love a good blender mr blender yes yeah and uh, blenders are just um you know don't just make milkshakes with them you know or, or daiquiris you know i use them to make <laughs> yeah just kidding yeah just kidding. absolutely <laughs> but salad dressings marinades um use your blender okay fantastic so we're gonna do a quick marinade and mm -hmm. we're gonna start with a little bit of water very good, very good. Um, we're going to do, um, do you like a little heat? Oh, a little bit of heat. A little bit of heat. Okay, so we're going to do a jalapeno mm -hmm. pepper. Mm -hmm. And if you like a lot of heat, <laughs> you can leave the seeds in there. But we're going to keep it, you know, we're going to be medium. Does that sound good to you? Sounds good to me. All right, and we don't have to totally finely dice it up because it's going to go right into our blender, and that's going to do the work. So it's the water, the jalapeno pepper, minus the seeds. A little bit of soy sauce. Mm -hmm. hey, uh, Daniel's on you too much TV. <laughs> I love soy sauce. I'm a big soy sauce junkie. Okay, and then cilantro. Oh, excellent cilantro. Yeah. Exactly how much? Um, a handful. Okay. So uh, I'll, I'll let you decide what a right. handful actually is. All right. All right. I just kind of you know wing it. I like a lot. Um, some people. I was talking. You. I'm a big cilantro fan. Mm -hmm. I can't get enough of it. Like Deb hates it. Mm. To her, it tastes like a bar of soap. It's not for everybody. Yeah. And, and besides, um, um, cilantro is, is such a unique thing. It, it requires, so, it yeah. really requires some thought. Yeah. I mean, it's, you know, yeah. there's such a thing as too much. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Okay. So what else? What all we have in there? Uh, we had soy sauce, water, cilantro, jalapeno pepper. Mm -hmm. We need, um, let's get that going. Okay. Ready? <clears throat> Five, mm, four, mm, three, mm, two, mm, one, mm. I think I've broken it. <laughs> I hope not. Um, a lime, a little lime juice. Um, oh, yes, lime is good. Sometimes those limes just don't want to give their juice. You know what I mean? Well, you put the lime in the coconut <laughs> and drink them both up. Put the lime in the coconut and call the doctor. Woke them up. <laughs> so, you know what you can do, actually? You can pop this in the microwave for like... Oh, five this will be seconds. interesting. This will be very yeah, interesting. Yeah, and it, it'll just kind of get that lime to release the juices. Really? Gets those juices flowing. Hey, you know? let her go. Yeah, hey, absolutely. release the little juice. Exactly. Forget about it. So, and it just softens right up. That's a good Excellent. little tip, you know? That's good. All right, so. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Right in here. Very. And I, I do like, I like a lot of lime juice, so we'll do like half a lime. You like lime? Oh, it's not, it's not good. I like. <laughs> You can do that again because I don't think the, the camera got you there. <coughs> it's okay. This is why it's gone. This and is why I'm not. Uh, this is why I'm not. A little wine, a little lime, it's all good. I cook with wine a lot, and I think, you know, it adds a lot of flavor. So uh, that'll get you going, huh? I think it's just wonderful. <laughs> Did you put that in there? Um, do, oh. You know, it's not in the recipe, but feel free if you want to put a splash a lot. Splash think, of lime in there? Yeah. Okay. All right, now we need a little bit of, yeah, go for it. Now we're going to keep this baby going. We're going right. to take the top off. You want to start a, a stir, chop, or mix? Um, let's do, uh, like, mix. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Shut up! It's just, it's just a blender. Okay, so there's our <laughs> marinade. Very nice. 
A little bit of it got out, but that's okay. Michael's cleaning up the kitchen afterwards. Uh, so then this is just going to get poured over our tuna steaks. Now, if you have a half hour, go have a glass of wine. and uh, have, or, have some of that. Or a bottle of wine. Um, but let it marinate in the fridge for, for about a half hour if you can. Minutes? But not like, you know, you don't want to go much longer than an hour. So don't oh, be having 30 minutes two, because, yeah, because yeah. the lime actually is cooking it. You know your stuff. I'm learning because yeah. I, I watch from afar. <laughs> <laughs> but I do know that it, it actually, this actually starts at the cooking process. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, do, so do lemons, but, uh, but at a higher rate. Yeah, very true. Hmm. I don't know about that. But, um, but yeah, citrus and, and any kind of acid is going to cook the fish. Mm -hmm. So you can do this. Fire up the backyard barbecue. Do you grill a lot in the summer? I do. Or in the, actually, in the summer. Ooh. Yeah, and you know what? I, I got a lot of oil in there, so what, mm -hmm. what I'll do is sometimes um, I just will sop it up a little bit with the paper towel. Excellent, okay. Just so we don't have, you know, that it's, fish is so great and it's healthy know. and stuff like that. Let's get her in there. All right, ready yeah. to begin? Yes, let's do it. We're going to use this one or are we going to use the one in the fridge? We're going to use this. This one? Okay, let's yeah. go for it. Wait a second, let me... Um... <laughs> Very nice. I don't know what I'm going to do without these great sound effects in the kitchen. What am I going to do come Monday? Very nice. Now, how do you like your tuna steak? Uh, kind of rare. Me too. I mean, it's such that. great, that's such nice, uh, he, you did such a great oh, job catching that. that, that we, you know. Is it gonna, are we going to sear this or cook? I'm going to sear it. Sear Here it? you go. Right, sear. There oh, you I, go. I love sears. I, <laughs> <laughs> I like it too. My husband gets all his tools there. Okay. Now we got one more thing we're gonna make. Excellent. You wanna man the fish here? Okay. Man the fish hour! <laughs> I'd be a pirate cooking me fish. We and you remember, the only movies we go to see are the ones rated. <laughs> we wanna get some nice, pretty, we got it really cranked up high. We wanna get okay. some nice grill marks. So we have to very quickly turn over? Yeah, I, and you'll, you'll kinda know when. Arr. So I'd you know how be to get looking those? good, lads. Yeah, we're just gonna turn it just a little bit. And then we'll just, get those oh. nice. Crisscross grill marks that you do at the restaurant. You're being very gentle with the fish. That's the reason why I'm not allowed in the kitchen because I, I throw stuff around. Yeah. yeah. All right, we've got one more thing that we're going to do. Yes. We are going to. Can you hand me that bowl over there? Excellent. I Your love it. Bowl, madam. Thank you so much. Yeah, yes, of course. Yeah. We're going to make a fruit salsa to go on top of this. So this is going to be pretty healthy, you know? Okay. Let you me know keep when we're supposed nice... to turn this. So oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do that. I always get to talking and I overcook things. We don't, oh, look at that. What do you think? Yeah? Looking good? Ooh. Oh, thank that, you. That is oh, gorgeous. Right. What do you think? Okay, so we're going to make a fresh fruit salsa just to dress this up, um, okay. to make it look pretty. Uh, and people think salsa, they think, you know, Mexican food and chips and all that kind of good stuff. Um, put that back down there. Okay. You want to get those sear marks. Oh, you want to get them? Yeah, man. You know? Oh, I don't want to end up on burn notice. <laughs> okay, so we're, um, you know, what's in season, whatever's in season. In Florida, you guys have great food all year round, pretty yes, much, Yes, we right? do. So and in, Cal in California, they have uh, flood, famine, fire. <laughs> Everything's in freedom. season there. Absolutely. So um, pineapple is looking really great. Excellent. So we're going to take some pineapple, some diced pineapple. Nice. You like strawberries? I do. I like strawberries, too. Mango, um, but the mangoes weren't too great. So at the grocery store that we picked up, they weren't quite ripe yet. So don't, yes. don't be using those. Um, little lime juice. How is our fish doing over uh, there? It's looking good. Is that how you, about you like it? That's about it. Okay. I, I say we get it to the plate. Plate it now. Got a okay. pretty plate there. Remember, this is why a lot of iron chefs didn't make it. They didn't plate on time. It's true. You got to be fast. I love that. I love Top Chef and Iron Chef. Oh, I love that. Addicted stuff. to that. Oh, look at that. I always run away from Gordon Ramsay. He's mean. Well, he's got food. He's got food flying. Yeah, that's that's true too. Remember the movie Animal House? Food flying. <laughs> Did you ever have one of those in school? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh. I, could, I could not explain why there was food in my hair when I got home. Oh, the, that is a big time detention. Uh, it is. I bet you were in detention a lot. No. Never? Never. Oh, not believe, even once. I don't believe that. Okay, so I need a little bit of that olive oil. We're just going to, I put a little lime juice in with this fruit okay, salsa. Where would you like the olive oil? Um, just drizzle, drizzle into that fruit. Just a dab. Perfect. A little bit more cilantro, just because we've got a little in the marinade and just going to use my fingers. Ow, this, is why it's hot. Hot. this is why it's hot. This is why it's hot. I'm just going to give that a toss. How about that? Excellent. And you did this. You I helped. Did? Yeah, you go home and make this for your wife. Fantastic. How about that? Let's do this at an angle so they can see. Yeah. It. Gorgeous. Recipes on our